Hello everyone, back to me to our channel Line with Manglam. So today's video, I am going to discuss about the hack with NV full process. Okay, so basically, I am going to discuss about the full roadmap. If you are not aware about the hack with NV, this is the Infosys program, guys. This is the Infosys program, which generally Infosys conduct a program for the internship opportunity as well as the full time opportunity, and they are uh, providing the hackathon also. Okay, so what is the hack with NV? I will discuss about this one, and what is the exact criteria? What is the exam pattern for this? This one and how to process in this one so in this video one by one i will cover all the things okay so just watch this video guys so uh what is the exact thing that i will first of all clear the what is hack with nv so hack with nv is a program in which generally enforces conductor program okay and who can apply in this one so if you are from the third year students so generally third year students and fourth year students okay fourth year and third year students are eligible to apply in this program this is the eligible criteria for this hiring opportunity guys okay so this is kind of the infosys biggest program generally uh, infosys providing like uh, that kind of the program that is hack with infi so i think eligibility criteria also clear to you guys who can apply in this one so if you are from the third year or fourth year then uh, the students are eligible mostly all time they are uh, setting the criteria this one okay and now what benefits they are providing so one one hackathon like uh, you are going to participate in the hackathon and one interview also which is the software engineer job role okay generally software engineer job role sc or sp also sp also they can provide that is a specialist programmer okay okay so these uh, two job roles they can provide through this hack with infi program okay that is also clear to you now i am going to cover about the uh, exact exam pattern like uh, uh, who can apply in this one and what is the exact pattern so guys if you are shortlisted for this uh, program now if you are shortlisted now like if you are from the third year and uh, fourth year students and if you are shortlisted from the college base so it is de it depends guys whether it is an on campus and off campus okay generally it is happening off campus also and sometimes it is happening off campus also okay so it depends it is going to on campus and off campus okay so that is also clear okay uh, now there will be different different rounds if you are appearing the online assessment if you are appearing the online assessment online test now then what is the round that is round one online assessment okay online assessment number of question three question will be there negative marking no negative marking and uh, allocated time three years you have to solve the three question in the three hours and cutoff is 1.5 to uh two question that you have to solve okay now i will discuss about this scenario right so what is the online assessment like three question three coding question will be there coding question will be there and you have to solve in the three hours right three hours three question you have to solve what is the level for the questions guys it is medium to high level guys medium to high level guys for this one what you have to prepare you have to practice from the lead code so guys lead code medium level question we can say they they are asking the medium level question and what is the chance like if you are like how many question you have to solve with the, for this one so basically the topics mostly topics from the dp dp some question like last year the students got shortlisted for this uh, program na, and uh, they got the hackathon chances also they got the interview also so what was the question they have like one dp problem was there and one problem was from the array okay one problem was from the array and you can also go through the stack guys you can go through the queues also right so basically medium level medium level dsc you can prepare if you are solving the lead code question if you are solving the code forces question uh, that will be helpful for you guys okay so the level will be higher like the question will be the dp array stack queue link list okay and one one question definitely one hard question will be there guys one hard question definitely they are asking so one hard question definitely definitely will be there and you have to prepare like that all also right and what is the exact cutoff day of mention so guys if you are solving like two and a half question out of three two and a half question now then mostly chances for the interview then you are getting for the interview at least interview right at least interview you will get okay and if you are solving three out of three three out of three now then you will uh, get the hackathon also okay so this is the one that you will get the hackathon also okay i hope it is clear to you guys like how it how it is going to be happen if you are solving the two and a half question then interview will be there and if you are solving three out of some then a hackathon also you can get like if you are solving like two and a half question also there will be a chance for the hackathon also right like if you are solving the 2.5 like uh, say uh, a second and a half question now you will get hackathon also guys 
ओके देर माइट बी नाइंटी परसेंट चांसेस फॉर दी हैकेथॉन एंड थ्री आउट ऑफ थ्री हंड्रेड परसेंट यू विल गेट दी हैकेथॉन आल्सो एंड इंटरव्यू आल्सो एंड इंटरव्यू आर गेटिंग दी इंटर्नशिप अपॉर्चुनिटी विच इज फॉर थर्ड ईयर एंड फोर्थ ईयर स्टूडेंट्स एज अ सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर और एज अ स्पेस टेस्ट प्रोग्रामर एज अ इंटर्न बेसिकली जनरली जॉब रूल इज नॉट कन्फर्ट फॉर दी ट्वेंटी देन जनरली दे आर प्रोवाइडिंग सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर दैट इज एसी जॉब रूल सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर जॉब रूल ओके For 2025, it is not confirmed the job role, but generally they are providing the internship opportunity. As a intern, you are going to work. So this is totally confirmed that you are going to work as a intern. Okay. So this is confirmed like online assessment. How to solve this one? Now after the online assessment, what is the second step? That is the second step. Step number two. That is technical interview. In the interview, like on which basis they are asking the question on the assessment basis they are asking the question or not so interview total technical there will be technical interview no uh, uh, like hr something uh, because this is a hackathon kind of interview right so technical interview only one round will be there there will be no additional round and there they are asking the coding questions also guys coding questions and medium level question they might ask to write the code for any problem okay and guys if you are pre preparing for the uh, interview na then what you should prepare so basically coding coding definitely because technical interview with you have to prepare for the coding and what type of section i will provide you the guidelines like if you are preparing for the interview hack with infi interview then what topics you should prepare first topic that is guys totally resume okay resume is very important okay resume whatever they are providing resume also if resume not if they are not asking for the resume because this is a application basis right you are just filling the application and on based upon that one only they are asking the question on based upon the online assessment they are asking the question if resume not needed then what else needed your technical abilities guys technical abilities needed technical abilities like programming like c++ if you know java you know or python okay any programming language that you know you have to prepare very well okay that programming language you have to prepare well very well and generally oops concept you can prepare very well that is very very important question and 100% i am sure they will they will ask definitely they are going to ask the oops concept definitely from the any programming language whether it is c++ java or python programming language oops concept they will definitely ask additional topic what you can prepare definitely dbms because dbms theoretical question they will ask definitely some sql query they might ask it is not confirmed they will ask or not but sql you need to know like dbms concept you need to know that is total cs fundamentals we can see cs fundamentals we can see right cs fundamentals you have to prepare that is cn computer network operating system os you have to prepare and dbms you have to prepare and sql you have to prepare right dbms you have to prepare so all cs fundamentals if you are preparing then you are good to go for the interview interview topics are clear for you guys if you are if you want to prepare for the interview na what topics you have to prepare the total technical interview will be there they might ask one problem to solve one coding problem to solve okay so you have to very uh, prepare about that one okay one coding problem they might ask it will be like medium level or easy level easy level also would be there so they might ask the medium to easy level uh, question okay after that if if you are clearing the online interview online interview then they will ask for the form right uh one form guys you have to fill fill that is survey form after the interview then survey form will be there where you have to you have to fill your all details why all details because for the hackathon okay if you are shortlisted from the interview then a hackathon will be there then you have to provide the details for the hackathon because they are going to uh, like uh, provide all the uh, benefits right like uh, accommodation also they are providing hackathon generally if you are participating hackathon then hackathon would be in office okay it would be in office only generally it if you are from the gen like generally pune office and mysore office right mysore office okay so it is an campus or campus uh, hackathon they are providing generally you have to uh, generally you have to go for the hackathon in office only okay in a office only you have to prepare the uh, hackathon okay so now what is the hackathon this one like what uh, they are asking the hackathon i will suggest you so suppose you go for the hackathon in office it is conducting right hackathon and hackathon what they are asking you have to create a team you have to create a team team of 5 to 4 4 to 5 members 
approx okay so like uh, whether you can create your own team or they are providing the members to create the teams yes they are providing the members to create a team which they are providing the members they are providing they are dividing the members and you have to choose the members and they will provide the one problem statement okay one problem they will provide and on that problem based you have to cho choose one problem and uh, with team you can discuss your problem with team you can discuss your problem and on that problem statement you are going to work and approximately that is four days four days hackathon in office okay clearly i have mentioned also you can clearly see round two that is a grand finale that is kind of hackathon also real world problem they are providing a negative marking no negative marking and four days hackathon will be there and in four days they are providing the accommodation also and in office only in office you are going to uh, attend this hackathon and what is the benefit for this hackathon so generally they are providing different different benefit they are providing the prizes they are providing the goodies to the final year students and third year students generally uh, before starting the hackathon also and after start after completion of the hackathon also they are providing different different prizes so this is kind of biggest hiring drive biggest opportunity for freshers if you want to prepare then you can generally uh, watch this video i hope Hope all doubts clear if you have any doubt you can put your comments then i will provide the answers also thank you guys thanks for watching